With the latest from News for Jax, I'm Joy Purdy. We're following breaking news from the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office, which tells us that 20-year-old Gregory James has been arrested and charged with murder in a deadly shooting outside a business on Edison Avenue in Mixon Town. This afternoon, JSO also announced the arrest of 24-year-old Delquan McGriff, charged with leading police on a chase. They're both being charged in connection with the death of 31-year-old Justin Sumler. Investigators say the shooting appeared to be the result of an ongoing dispute, maybe over money. Jacksonville Mayor Lenny Curry says that the city doesn't get a new shipment of the coronavirus vaccine. They'll have to stop distribution at two senior centers. During a news conference earlier today, Mayor Curry said the city has so far distributed more than 8,000 vaccine doses at those centers. But if no more are sent to Jacksonville, they'll run out on Thursday. And Washington, D.C. is seeing swarms of National Guard troops preparing to protect the area from any suspicious behavior surrounding President-elect Joe Biden's inauguration. There are approximately 25,000 troops on the ground in the city right now. Today, we've learned that 12 National Guard members with ties to far-right groups have been removed from duty, and more than 40 have been removed after reportedly contracting COVID-19. You can always find the latest news on newsforjax.com. Have a great afternoon.